watched it in my elf haul and on my blog and stuff so Ooh, blinding you Sorry. so I'm looking over there it's because I need to see what I'm doing <laughs> okay so I have my mirror let's give this a try I'm going to put it on my face and then blend it out with a elf flat top powder brush which works amazing for Let's give it a whirl. I do have a little bit of a pimple there. See how well it covers that. Not too bad, I guess. I'm going to try and just dip my brush right into the foundation like that and um Just gonna make sure it's very, very blended. Okay, so my first impressions of it. Um, I don't know if. Blended really easy, which was the nice. finish of it on my skin. Just gonna warm it up and rub it in with my hands and see if it changes the way it looks on my face. Cause I'm not so keen on how um, dry and cakey it looks. It really, really sticks to dry points in your face, like really badly. So my first impression of this product is if you have even the slightest amount of dry skin, this is not for you. Um, packaging gets dirty quick. Uh, this is for really oily skinned people, I would think. Um, but I've watched some reviews, but with people with really, really oily skin, it breaks down easily, but I don't know. You need, like, perfect skin for this to work. It doesn't really cover. Like, I have a blemish right here, and it's still red. You can still see it, but, like, my face is, like, cakey and stuff. I don't know. It's, um, not very nice. I don't. I don't really like this, and I really kind of wanted to like it. Just, I don't know, I'm trying to, I guess, get it off my skin. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys!
cha-cha-cha. Mm-hmm.